Alright nerds, how's it going? Welcome back to Trova Saves the Universe. So uh, we got the first two crystal babies and we've got to go back to the Abstainer's Sanctum. So let's get on with it, shall so we? listen, you heard a lot of stuff about me from Gail and uh, all the stuff Gail said I did, it's true. I don't know why I'm telling you this. I I'm a different person now than I was, you know? I did used to be cherished. And yeah, I used to pee in the sink. And yes, I, I fucked a shrinkle and a dinkle. But I'm changed. I feel changed since I've been with you and kind of we've been going on doing all this stuff together. I feel different towards Cherorpians, you know? I y you're just like me. We're on another level of friendship now. I drink a beer with you at my favorite drinking hole, the Empty Peepers. That's the place in my home world that I love to go to. They know how to deliver a drink right into your eye holes, but I'm sure we'd figure out a way for you to enjoy a drink there too. I'd tell them you're my pal, my Cherorpian pal, and I'd defend your back because I know they'd all be really cherished towards you because most of my planet is cherished. But anyways, you're my best friend now. Let's go finish up this shit. We're gonna be done with this and then you and me are gonna be in Empty Peepers. Yeah, cool. Shut the fuck up. Let's get on with it, shall we? Oh, jeez. He seems wasted. Oh, man. You know, I've been dying to tell you guys. You know, you know why Glorcon's doing all this, right? It's because of his true love. He's been trying to create the perfect recipe of planet combinations to bring about the existence of his dream girl. You know, his true love. What? Yeah, since Glorcon was able to see all the future eventualities, he's engineered the one that would result in, you know, his true dream girl coming hello, into... Hello, Cherorpian. Hello, Trover. Please hurry, install the crystal creatures... Yeah, I know. He's, he's gone a bit mad. I'm not drunk. I'm just... Uh, uh, uh. Noise. Uh, 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 right, that's all three of them. That feels better. We got three. If only we could be four. Uh, all right, so so what what do you want us to do? To, you know, to help you get to be four. What do you well, I have to get the two more crystals. You did. Find two more of the crystal creatures, and then somehow Stand. get them plugged into Glorcon's eye holes. That will unite the four of us, and we will once again be back normal and the, the whole thing, the reunited thing. That we talked, talked about, about earlier in the game. game. All right, okay, we're gonna head out. Good, head out. And as you walk back to the telepod, we'll just go ahead and let you know that, you know, we don't know what's going on. You know, our brains are all amok. You know, it's all muddied. We can't really predict the future of anything right now because Glorcon's yeah, cool. Let's go out there changing the present. Oh. You know, he's doing things that we don't know what the hell those the rippling effects are. We don't even know what he's up to. We have no idea what he's doing, but all we Yeah, I get is, the point. Right, it, cool. So, uh, sure. yeah, so last episode was pretty funny. The, the uh, life, and, and he was talking about um, his old roommate, Trover's old roommate. Uh, anyways, Gail was what, talking what, about what, Trover, what like, about? shitting in his We're mouth or something. Uh, yeah, it all got a bit weird. But, uh, you know. That's kind of what we have uh, learnt to expect from this game so far. So... Just shut the fuck up. Alright, fine. Alright, Cherorpi and Trover, good work. I see you've uh, got the abstainers all linked up. That's good to hear. Yeah. Now, you're going to have to get those last two crystals and you're going to want to go meet my buddy. One of my pals. A fella named... George. He's got the next pair of special creatures stored in a secret place, secret planet. He'll probably hand them over to you with little effort on your part. He's a good dude, one of my best pals. And uh hope you guys cool. Chair Fair enough. you doing you feeling pretty good? You doing okay? Yeah, feeling alright. Alright, fuck shit up. Good. That's good to hear. I'm happy to hear that you're feeling good. Alright, get out there and we're getting close. We're getting close to the final part of this whole thing. Boss, I'm feeling a little weird right now because we just found out Glorcon's motivation is just true love. Oh, oh, that makes you feel weird, does it? Does that make you feel weird, Chair Orpian? Nah. Yeah, I didn't think it was relatable. Who's ever... Love is a joke anyways. No one's ever felt real love. That's, that's a sign of a sociopath lunatic if you feel love. Relatable, my shoe. You two get out of there, get out of here and go talk to Ch uh, uh, George. You're a bunch of do doofuses. Go, get your work done. George, go talk to him. Yeah, get yeah, yeah. There. Hurry up, get a hustle on. Oh. Okay, there we go. Weird Earth. Alright. Let's go with it. We've got to go talk to his mate George, apparently. 
What random inane bullshit are you going to say to me now, Trover? Oh, good. Nothing. Oh, hello. Oh, hey, what's going on? I'm bathtub guy. Oh, shit. Oh, I I'm so sorry. Hey, partner, I, I don't think this is George. Uh, the telepod might have misfired. Oh, yes, I'm George, but when I'm in the bathroom, people call me bathtub guy. You guys here to play a little midnight shuffle? I mean, listen, we do have big stuff to do, but uh, I, well, I, maybe? What's midnight shuffle? You know <laughs> midnight shuffle. It's when two consensual adults tuck in their chub, hop in a tub, and sit knee to knee. Yeah, no, I, no, why would we want to do that? Because <laughs> it feels good. Look, I gotta be at a birthday party in about an hour, but if we hurry, I'm sure we can get it done. All right, look, hey, listen, we're not here for some midnight shuffle, okay? Our boss sent us here to pick up some crystal babies. Oh, shit, well, why didn't you say so? I know, boss, that SOB owes me 13 space dollars and 15 space hairs. <laughs> he came over one time for a little cream dream action. That's when two dudes turn up the AC really high, then sit in the bathtub full of cream corn and scream their ever-loving ass off. Ooh, we is fun. Okie dokie. <laughs> anyway, 12 days go by, and we finally get out of the tub, right? I mean, look at our bodies. We're all pruny. My fingers were so tiny, I wanted to touch them. And just as he's about to leave, I go... Hey, man, that'll be 13 Space De Niro. And he's like, 13 what? Then, all of a sudden, Boss takes off running. Now, I don't know if you know this or not, but Boss is as agile as a greased baby going down a water slide. So, the only way I'm going to catch him is if I pull out my hookah kooky and give him a whirl of pearly. So, that's what I do. I mean, that in real estate, of course. I've been selling a lot of real estate in Manhattan lately, so that's been working out. But property values are going up the roof. <laughs> so it's hard to find clients who actually want to invest into a property. But I always try to tell them, invest early. Because if you don't, you'll be caught in a snowstorm later wishing you had. You don't want to be stuck in an apartment paying four thousand. Oh, I get to the point. When you could have this bit's not that funny anymore. Hurry up. Street for less than that, do you? Ten years down the line, you won't even. Hey, this is porcelain, bitch. Don't hit this. <laughs> Shit, look, I'm sorry, man. Okay, 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 right. So, do I come to your home and hit you when you in your tub? Seriously, have I? Cause that would be rude. Don't do it to me. Okay, cool. So, but my mother always says. Let's get on with it. Guy, shut up about real estate. <laughs> yeah, I, I agree with that. Talking about it because it's a great. Im Don't disrespect me by touching my duck. What the hell is wrong with you, partner? Would you just listen to him? Now, as I was saying, but I just keep on talking about it because it's a great investment if you want to make some. Hey, put that down. Oh my god. Oh my god, that's amazing. Partner, you just killed this guy! George, or whatever, <laughs> bathtub guy, whatever his name is. How many innocent lives is this now? Four or five? Oh my Are we god. Even the good guys anymore? I mean, Jesus Christ. As soon as we see an opportunity to kill someone, we do it. Pretty soon people are gonna just need saving from us. Not that, it, not that any of that matters, because without the crystal babies, we can't continue. This is crumbelievable. You broke the progress of the game. It's <laughs> over. You can't progress anymore. You're gonna have to restart the whole game and start all the way over from the very beginning. And when you get to this part, don't kill this bathtub character. Um. What? I wish you could jump me in that bathtub and kill me too, but there's some invisible wall collision thing there. This is bullshit. Talk about fucking the fourth wall break the there. Game. Um. So what can I do? Can I pick level and go back? There must be a way you can go between levels because, uh... Oh dear. Am I in trouble? Yeehaw, partner! It's me, David. I got them crystal babies that you gave me to watch here in Tech World, where I live in Tech World, but their little crystal feet keep scratching my goddamn floors down. Oh, nice. You got any of them crystal baby rubber shoes I can put on their feet? Call me back, you old son of a bitch. Holy shit, this is crumbelievable. I think I might be related to that guy, and also, I know exactly where Tech World is. 
I know how to get Sick. there too. It's already okay. programmed. The the coordinates are programmed in the telepod already. Come on in. The game isn't stuck. We can keep going. We can keep progressing. Good. Let's get a move Hit on the to tech world. I wonder if um that was just a random thing I'd worked out I could do, but that isn't the way you're actually meant to do it. I'd like to think that that's just a random added like Easter egg and that if I'd have left it long enough he would have just told me anyway. This but, is unbelievable the smell. But who here. fucking knows? We gotta get a move on. We gotta yeah. go to tech world. Like we gotta go to tech world partner. Let's electrocuted man. This place is, is he the laughing? smell in here is crumbelievable. Anyway, let's get a fuck on with it, shall we? Wow, partner, would you take a look at this cool tech world, this gear world? Man, this is going to be a fun one to explore. I can't wait to you sure about that? dive into every nook and cranny of this cool tech world. <laughs> He's waving his little legs. Uh, Looks like they're right. trapped in some force fields inside of a weird mech machine. Let's go get them. Okay, so how do I get undo those force fields? Interesting. All right, so I can't go that way. I've got to go this way. Let's get him along here. Keep him centralized. Oh crap! These guys oh, again. Buggers. Stupid dumb pieces of shit. We're gonna really fuck him. Just hit the fucker. There we go. Ow! Took a big hit then. Oh god. Oh, look who it is. It's fuck face and shit ass. You're both fuck face fuck and shit ass. We're not fucking around. Oh, yeah, very that's nice. Right. We're gonna fucking murder you. Yeah, you tell him. I am telling him. What the fuck are you doing? I'm gonna fight. I'm, I'm preparing myself to fight. Why are you being so quiet? Fuck you. I'm not being That's quiet. it. Gonna hit you up the ass. I'm fucking. That's it. I'm fucking. What the fuck? I'm in murder mode. You're in murder mode, are you? We are loyal to our DNA father. Yeah, so fuck you, buddy. Ow. Ow. Get out the purple shit. Yeah. Throwing weapons at him and shit. Eat this. Man, those Glorcon clones. Bunch of idiots. Yeah, fucking no knobheads. Right. Which way do I want to go? Are. No time to soak in the landscape. We gotta get these these crystal creatures. It looks like I wanna go up there, to but I need to turn eyes. them off first. Turn the things off. Hmm. Well, I can't go that way, so I have to go this way. Alright, here we go. Nice bit whoa, of platforming. Whoa, gears, Brilliant. Whoa, on the gears. Yep, we are on the gears. Correct. Oh, shit. Whoa, right. Over here. Oh, yep. And then over here. Right. That looks horrible and electrocuty. So I don't really think I want to go that way. Partner, let's let's get these crystal creatures and Ooh. get back to the telepod and find out nice. what the hell boss wants us to do. How, how he expects us to plug Oh great, here we Look go. Who thought they were gonna fucking Get to the oh, of this. more of these losers. Nice. Ouch. Yeah, shit indeed. No, fuck I you. Feel kinda bad for these guys. Ah, fuck them. Um, let's go over it. And then over here. So can I get one of those straight away? Is that gonna happen? Press the button. Right, oh, well, not one of these a puzzles. Of the, a couple of them power babies. This shit's too easy. We're walking through this like a homeless person walks through. Holy shit! Oh. Partner, we gotta grab the crystal babies. They're, they're down over by the telepod. We gotta get them and let's get the hell out of here. That's, it's not gonna be that simple though, is it, mate? Uh, let's have a look. If I jump off there. Partner, we gotta grab the crystal babies. Can I go straight back to there? The we gotta yeah. Get them. Let's get the hell out of here. If we can get them that easily, I'll be very surprised. Do I, do I not just pick them up? Do I... Oh, uh-oh. <laughs> 
surprised. Oh, shit. That's right. I, you played right into my hands. You're a couple of fucking idiots. The bomb I planted okay. in your telepod was never intended to kill you or the abstainers. I wanted you to merge the abstainers. You want to know why? Because of this. With this device, I'm going to be able to merge a bunch of worlds using, that's right, the power of the abstainers. Now with the crystal babies plugged into my device, oh. they're connected to the other three abstainers. Here we go. <laughs> it worked. And this is just the start. <laughs> Achievement. That went well. Of worlds. My next machine is going to include the power of your dogs. And it's going to merge 87 worlds down to five massive ones all in one fell swoop. Unfortunately, it's going to kill the other three abstainers as well as your dogs in the process. What a shame. Oh, what a shame. Fuck you. Too bad you're trapped here with no way out. I don't Close care about the, the abstainers, water, but no don't kill my dogs. Pod. All according to plan. Now that everything's all jumbled up, no one's gonna be able to help find you. Good luck, you shit fucks. Suck my balls. <laughs> Suck my balls. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh now law. Oh jeez, partner. Now we're trapped with no place to go. We're basically like Tom Hanks and Castaway. You know, we're gonna have to live the rest of our lives here. Oh god, I see what he says about I mean, the places being mixed Gorkhan together, because now that whack a hole is over is there. Horrible. I mean, you know, we gotta focus on survival now. We got we, we gotta just let everything forget about the dogs. Forget about, you know, trying to stop Lorcon. It's Tom Hanks style now from Castaway. So where do I wanna go Ever first? That movie? I mean you should check it out real quick. That way. And then come back so we we're gonna have to well, deal with this. I mean, this. We're, we Can I go start that way? Out where we're gonna get food. We, we should start oh, he's walking really slowly. Shelter. Hurry the fuck up. Hello, excuse me. Ooh. We need some help here. Hey, hey, uh, what's, what's going on? Boss sent me out here. Said there was some commotion going on, so I came in my Z telepod. Have you heard of one of those? Of course you haven't. It's my fucking telepod. It's the newest <laughs> telepod. I just cleaned it outside, inside. I fucking love that telepod. Uh, it's just over there. The commotion you're talking about is just right around the corner. All right, cool. I'm going to solve this mystery. I'm going to get to the bottom of this. I'm Pink Trover. There's going to be a whole spinoff of me on this game. I got a story, too. I'm Pink. I'm awesome. And I'm going to figure this shit out. Nobody's going to fuck with me. I'm Pink Trover. Okay. Um, Interesting. Pink fucking version of me. There's a lot of us. It has a fucking telepod. You heard him. It's right around the corner. Let's go. Hurry. It's our only way out of here. I don't want to be fucking trapped here for the rest of my life. Is that his one, or is that was that my one? My oh, one, by the look God, of it. That poor pink trover. What an idiot. What a dummy. Holy shit. But also, wow, this is a really nice, fancy telepod. I mean, it's better it than that garbage one. we've been using this whole time. I mean, it's got different. It's different colors. I think this is a T8000 model. Wow. It's got all kinds of doodads in here. I mean, it all looks pretty much in, the same, but I mean, there's all kinds of doodads in it. Did I just Partner, get? Boss is calling. You got. You got to answer the phone. I think I just got an achievement for scoring. I didn't notice it go in the hoop, but apparently it did. Awesome. Right. Uh. Yeah. Let's answer the phone. Uh. We don't fucked up. What, what did you find? Out? Oh, it's you two. I must have misdialed. Trover, Cherorpion, things are looking very grim. Several wor worlds have been merged. Your dogs and the abstainers are going to be killed. I can't get a hold of the abstainers. Glorcon's blocked access to their inner sanctum. Telepod is blocked from going there too. Come to my office. Hurry. I I'll brief you there on what the next steps are, but this shit is all totally changed. Shit's all fucked up. It's unpredictable. Everything yep. just took a giant left turn. I'll see you at my office. Uh... Okay. We fucking played right into Glorcon's hands. We're 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 fucking idiots. He's a, he, Speak for yourself, mate. So uh, a let's go. Genius. He played us like a fiddle. Important cosmic jobs, and, and eh? And now he's got control of the abstainers, and and he's and he's um and he's got the crystal babies. We need those fucking crystal babies, you know? And, and yes, we do. Still. I know. We haven't really done anything. We're we gonna go get them. Anything. I mean, this might as well be the beginning of the video game. I mean, we might as well have started the video game like right here, narratively. Because that's basically where we're at. Nah, we're fuck you. We're basically at the fucking be beginning, aside from all the fucking, you know, 
narrative story arc but between you and me and like you know our friendship and all that stuff <laughs> rolled into the wall well, got it this may as well be the boot up screen for the game right now oh because shut up winjin no we're locked. not jesus christ what the fuck are we gonna do shit i didn't see this coming D did you see this coming yes or no, no? really Come on. Not uh, your fucking peanut head. yes did you see this shit oh really you, you, you saw this coming yeah I, I i find that very highly unlikely fuck you fucking lying Little peanut. Come on head. in. Now let's get the fuck out of here and figure this shit out. Fucking start on me. Excuse me, lion, you little prick. Oh, hello. Trover, Chair Orpion, what took you so long to get back here? What were you, playing with your ding dong? Yes or no? Uh, yeah. Ah, uh, you were playing with your ding dong. That's good. It's healthy, it's natural, it's hot, it's sexy, and it's gonna help prepare you with what I have to tell you right now. A bunch of worlds are all destroyed. You know, th th this device is being powered by the abstainers through the crystal babies. All right, y boss, w w what do the abstainers say? I mean, w w what do the abstainers want us to do? We've lost all contact with the abstainers, Trover. The last thing yeah, they said to me was the Glorcon was planning to blow up a bunch of planets in the Tarvo galaxy, which is admittedly very, very far away and fairly inconsequential to us, but still... It's it's just a bunch of crazy bullshit. Wait a minute, so all, all he was gonna do was just merge a handful of worlds together? That's a big deal, Trover. This motherfucker merged a bunch of worlds together, and uh, uh, quite frankly, we don't know if he's gonna do it again. I think he probably will. Well, Jesus Christ, what the fuck are we gonna do? This guy's this guy played us. That's right, Trover, he played you. I, I've been busy playing cards. Now shut the fuck up. <laughs> L listen to me, I have a plan. We still have the coordinates to Glorcon's home planet. That's where he's keeping his world merging device. That's where his secret base is. And that's where the crystal babies are. The only problem is the planet is being shielded by a giant impenetrable force field. All we have to do is shut down the force field. It's easy. Well, how do we do that? What, what the fuck? What, what, what are we supposed to do? Trover, we got to blow up Mixed World. Mixed World is powering Gorkon's force field around his secret base planet. You, wanna, you want us to blow up a planet? A bunch of planets that are merged together? Are you fucking serious? You, you hear Trover, yourself? I don't want to hear any more of this out of you. Cherorpian, do you think you're up for this? Uh, yeah, fuck it, why not? Oh, yeah, confident, huh? Real confident. You better be. And quit trying to play with your little ding-dong. This is serious. We gotta save the this localized area of the cosmos. And you're sitting there trying to play with your little ding-dong in here. Anyway, Glorcon just destroyed the a little. handful of worlds, merging them together, and he created one giant mixed world. That's a problem. He's also gonna kill your dogs, Cheerorpion, and the abstainers are gonna die too. I mean... Is that enough stakes for us? I mean, you got all that, Trover? I only really give a shit about the dogs. Yeah, yes, yes. To be honest. Okay, we got Fuck it. Okay, the on this mixed world, there's a bomb planting site. You're going to need to plant a bomb in that receptacle. Where the fuck are we? Where's this bomb you're talking about? Where, where I'm we? getting to that, Trover, goddammit. If you let me yeah, Trover, finish shut my conversation. Fuck up. In order to get the bomb, you're going to need to go talk to my good friend, one of the funniest guys I know, comedy guy. He's my best friend, one of my best friends, and oh, he also God. happens to be a bomb expert. And, and he'll tell some hilarious jokes. He'll lift your spirits. His name is Comedy Guy. He has the bomb. So He's just, almost guaranteed to be ready, unfunny, press right? Press the button on the telepod and it'll take you to Comedy Guy. And then a guy called there, Comedy Guy in this game Jesus is Christ, probably going to be mess. not funny. Partner, come on. Hit the button. Let's go to Comedy Guy and get this bomb. Club Maybe Laffy. Maybe we'll hear some jokes. I, I don't know. Uh, man, you know... You know, whenever the chips are down, Comedy Guy's there to get, to give you a little laugh and a chuckle you know he, he always brings a smile to the table uh-huh he's you know and he's got a good lovable you know rated g type sense of humor uh e for everyone tone with his comedy he's very but it'll still make the edgiest person laugh because his comedy is so sharp and honed and he's just, he's such a light, delightful, lovable, yeah, happy-go-lucky character. He's always funny and laughing and just having uh -huh. a great time. And, and it's so, it's, and he also happens to know a lot about bombs and, you know. Cool, let's get on with it, shall we? How to make really. Enough of your bullshit. Man, this is a bunch of bullshit. I can't believe yes. Lorcon played us like he did. And, and oh, yeah, shit even says my school. I had been with you or not, I, I, I could have been doing my own thing this whole time, you know? I, mean, I stuck around with you for what? And, and now we gotta blow up a planet? I mean, Jesus Christ. That sounds like what bad guys do, blowing up planets. Uh, all right, look. Let's just check out Comedy Guy's routine, get the bomb, and then go blow up this entire planet. We already killed plenty of people, so I don't know what you're worried about. 
You've seen his lighthearted comedy on Fleam Shack. No, you know him from his silly family-friendly prop comedy masterpiece, Floppy Props. And he's been a regular on David Letterman for years. Let's give a warm round of applause to Comedy Guy. Oh. Oh, my God. <laughs> he hung himself. You know, he, he always jokes Funny. about it, but I just thought he was doing a bit. Jeez, do you know how fucking hard this has been for me? And, and now I have to deal with this? What, what am I, the, the guy from 127 Hours? Did you see that movie? <laughs> the guy got the shaft. Big rock fell on his arm. This is 127 hours, plus an extra hour. 128 hours of me getting screwed. <laughs> um... We were supposed to get a bomb. We were supposed to pick up a bomb from this guy. Where is the bomb? Oh my God! You know th this isn't my fight. I didn't. I didn't. Holy Ooh. shit! It's the bomb. There it is. There's the freaking bomb. L let's get it and get the hell out of here. That looks like a very shitty bomb. Uh, Partner, please, just let's go. Anything else just I can get do? Get me in the telepod, please. I want to get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Fucking hell. I didn't expect that. This that was awesome. This isn't my war. Fuck this! I just wanted I want to, to score get another goal. Some power, baby. Get in the fucking and, basket. And now this, I'm like Swan D over here. The, oh. You know the, the the guy that was arrested for a little too much pep in his step. The guy did jack shit. He just skipped across the street. This is bullshit. His name was Swan Z. Oh fuck it. Um. God, all right, I, get back in. I, I Come on. I just want to go. I just want to get out of here, please. All right, but where to? What a bunch of bullshit! Ah, so now we're going to mix well. Glorcon's merging planets in the Tarvo Galaxy. Nobody cares about the Tarvo Galaxy. That place is so far away. This is like if if it were in the very beginning of the game, narratively, story-wise, like the beginning of the game. Oh fuck off! Well you already Simon said that. Birch from that one movie. I'm hitting pop flies and killing moms. It's bullshit. Yeah, you're bullshit. Right, okay, cool. So, Mixed World is obviously uh, another proper this? level, because it's got Shit. 20 babies to collect. So, uh, uh, I think we're going to call it there. Uh, we've learnt out a lot, of, learnt a uh, bit more stuff this, about what's going man. on, and what we got to do next. So, in next episode, we're going to go to Mixed World place. and blow the fucking shit out of it. I don't feel happy uh, anymore. Yeah, I don't feel good right now. Shut up. Fuck to you two. Man, yeah, I get the picture. This is bullshit. <laughs> You've turned Fuck into a right whiny little bitch, haven't you? Right, yeah, so next episode, Fuck we're going to go to Mixed World and do all that. So uh, until then, I'll see you next time. See you later, nerds. Fuck.